Welcome back to Fallout 3. We're here at our little hotel room because no matter what I did, I waited like 72 hours and I could not get the vendor's stock to respawn or her money to respawn. Kind of weird. So I just stuck the stuff I needed to sell in here. So we're going to leave that here for now. It's not going to go anywhere, I don't think. So, I got my battle armor on. Hanging on to this. Might need that. I'm hanging on to... Let's see if we need to repair Sydney's. We can. That worked good. We still have a sniper rifle. Well, we can use it up, though, so that's good. Well, it's not going to gain us anything, so let's not use it yet. We'll use it when we need it. And Sydney's is at, man, that's 96 damage. Holy crap. Well, we'll start using that, too. I don't have any drugs, do I? Ah! Let's see. Do I have any drugs going on here? I just got some withdrawal. Superior Defender. Damage resistance is plus 10. We have Cycle Withdrawal. So my damage resistance is plus 10 when I'm standing still. Okay. My endurance is down because something I withdraw, cycle withdrawal. Okay. There's no doctors around here, though, is there? Anyway, we're going to do this quest, the Velvet Curtain, which is way the hell up here. So. This is going to be interesting. We got to go this way. So we're heading out into the wilds. And that is literally what this place is like. It is pretty freaking wild out there. As you can see, those guys, they hit pretty hard that were in the hotel there. But everything in this game, in this DLC, hits pretty hard. Let's do a save because I don't know what's going to happen. And let's see, we might as well discover some stuff while we're roaming around. Um, let's try and see. Let's put Sydney's SMG on. I don't know what that's going to do for me, but we'll give it a shot. There's something to discover right here. And there's something to discover right here. Oh, here's something. Let's go do this. This looks I don't I don't know what's over there, but this looks at least like a house. Somewhere out here there's another vendor, I think. Which, that sucks now because I offloaded all my stuff. Is this it here? Let's see. What is a cola machine? I only need three more colas to get me a quantum. Yeah, I think this is a vendor. I think. There we go. Woohoo! And a quantum. Can't go wrong with that. Is this all steel? None of this is steel. Well, let's take these fission batteries here. Take this, and we'll take the conductors. And maybe we can sell them. The glue I don't need. What's this? Switchblade. And I guess we'll take the Abraxel, too. Uh, BB gun, BB gun. Let's see what's in here. I think this is a... I can't remember. If this is a, what do we got here, buff out? We don't need that. Haley's hardware. Let's see. Where's Haley? Oh, right here, this guy. 
I also can do repairs if and you need it. Well, hello there. Welcome to, uh, welcome to Haley's Hardware. We have hardware. Is there something wrong? No, no, not at all. I'm just not used to people all the way out here. My usual customers, well, I usually smell them before I see them. <laughs> Who are you? Swamp customers? Coat mostly. I guess they don't bother me none because I was born here. They mostly trade meat and fruit, never any cash or goods. The mercs are good for some trade and real hardware. So if you need ammo or anything like that, I can help you out. So how long have you had this store? Oh, you're thinking, no, no, it's not a family thing. I took the name of the store when I found this place a couple of years ago. Truth is, I don't even remember much before that. I woke up here with a headache a couple of years ago with the shop already set up. People came in and started trading. I didn't complain. It just became a job. Okay, where did you stock from? I found some of it. Uh, some was here when I got here. I got some from the Mercs. And every once in a while, that weirdo with the boat comes up here and trades a few good things. Okay. Sure thing. Are you here to buy something? Uh, sure as a swamp repair. folks head is squishy. Step rifle tire and roving trader outfit. Not that that matters. Nope. Got to go in business with you. Now let's um put on my trader outfit. Let's trade. Good to see y'all alive, friend. That's what I'm here for. Oh, he's only got 173 caps. What the hell, dude? I will sell whatever we can. Let's see. Uh, let's get rid of these freaking fishing batteries. Yep, that's what I was afraid of. Let's take one back. 173. 39 left. Conductor. All right, so what's he got? Anything good? Missile launcher? Hmm. Hunting rifles, frag mines, frag grenades. I don't think I need any frag grenades. F-32, that's, we're pretty good with that. Uh, let's see what he's got here. Uh, cover, workman's coveralls. They're like all over this place. Whiskey, sugar bombs. So he doesn't have a whole lot. Alright, um, what about, we actually have some pre-war money to sell him, right? I can sell one. Yeah, I almost got all this money. Alright. Talk not about much you. to tell. What do you want to know? We've already been here, haven't we? Yeah, we've done all sure this. Sure thing. Are you here to buy something? We already did it, thank you. Good doing business with you. All right, so everything he's got. Ooh, he's got a workbench. That's good to know. I don't care, mine. I can steal, but I don't need to steal it. So he has a workbench. And I have, well, I don't have them on me now. If need be. Well, I got the Nuka grenades. Wait a minute, hold on a second. I've got some Nuka. Uh, Quantums. I got some Abraxo. I got some Turpentine. I don't have any tin cans though. Okay, gotta remember that. I just need two tin cans. Alright, let's put my armor back on. And where's the door? Behind me? Where the hell's the door? This way, I guess. Where the hell's the door? Here? That's the bathroom. Must be right here somewhere. Come on! I came in a door. Seriously? That's his bedroom. What the hell? Come on. There it is. These doors always look boarded up in this DLC. I 
Let's see if there's any tin cans out here. Steam gauge assembly. Conductor and fission battery, yeah. Um, I'll take them for now, I guess. Wonder why this stuff isn't marked as steel. Give me some tin cans, man. You got all this trash lying around here. All I need is two tin cans. Let's do a save here because I just did a whole bunch of weird shit. Didn't like that little skip. Wild punga fruit, huh? Let's take that. We might need that. Some something. I I got something in the back of my head about punga fruit. That's what's in this area. All right, let's go. Let's see. We were going. We're going this way, and there's another. Let's see. There was a discoverable thing over here. Let's go this way first. So is this is this a travel location? Let's see. Yeah, we can travel here. Okay. So there was something over here. How is that building over there in the distance? That looks like a brand new building. Oh, is that the freaking? That is, that's the boardwalk. We don't want to go that way. We want to go this way. Which I don't really want to go this way either, but... Is that the hotel over there? That looks like the hotel, so we're, we're kind of not going in the right direction here. Hold on a second. There was the hardware store. That's the hotel. We want to go this way. There, that's right. Okay, back on track. This is where I was going before. There's a marker right here on the compass and see what's over here. This place does look a lot like Far Harbor. I don't think the sun ever shines here. Haven't seen any locals yet. Ark and Dove Cathedral. I was making all that weird noise. Stop it! Alright, there's something here. Wait a minute, tin can? Tin can. I only need two tin cans. That's a bent one. Here we go. So we can go make some nuclear grenades now. Right, because I have two quantums. Two quantums. And I got everything else. We should go do that. Let's see what else is here first. More punga fruit. There's some scrap metal. Uh oh, this don't look good. This is these are the guys here, a tracker. These guys are they're pretty crazy.
Uh oh. distance. <laughs> I did hardly any damage to that guy. <laughs> Get up again. He's not moving. He's glitched there. Oh wait, what the hell's that? Is he coming for me? I can't tell. Knocked him down again. Clip it again, man. Come on, cut it out. It's hiding. Cut it out. Look at that. <laughs> the game's wonky, man, I swear. Finally. Right, so I didn't discover anything here. Uh, let's get Sydney's SMG back up. That's what I wanted to use. Do a save. I want to discover something. And then we can fast travel back to Haley's Hardware. And make some nuka grenades. What's this guy got? These guys ain't got crap from weaponry or anything, do they? Nah. Ain't got nothing. Where's a discoverable location? There's a couple of them up here. Psycho? Oh, that helps. Man, there's all kinds of discoverable locations here. Let's see. Yeah, there's a building right here. Let's see what it is. Swamp folk. A brawler. We got brawlers and we got trackers and we got scrappers. Ooh, we got him in one shot. That's good to know. Is that a brawler or a tracker? A brawler. Can't get him from here. Where'd he go? There he is. Oh, that's a that's a tracker there, ain't it? Yep. These guys are pretty crazy.
Really? Guys carry dr uh, drugs, don't they? Nice. And he's got alcohol. All right, let's go see what's over here. This is gonna be red. Shit here. So let's go see if we can discover this location anyway. See, I don't like that I can't get the little sound that ding ding you discover something because I, I'm not getting XP anymore. Marguerite Shack, huh? Alright, let's go in here. Moonshiner Shack, huh? Eh, let's put some jammies on just in case. You, find you ain't have the look of a local, son. Think you could help a sick woman get on the man? It's kind of hard to say you're sick. What's Reckon the matter? Reckon it's the orange fever. I do feel light in my head. Hmm. I've treated enough illnesses to know there's no such thing as orange fever. Now that is just an awfully rude thing to say, sweetie. <laughs> you're faking. We both know. Let's see if this well, works. Oh, fine, maybe you're no hog's fool, but I reckon we both come out better if you can help me cook up some tonic. Let's talk about this tonic. Secret family technique. Been so for generations. Help me brew some up by gathering ingredients. I'll share the batch to make it worth your while and sweeten the, the deal with fruit. 300 caps. Uh, what do we need? Okay, what is this stuff Tell first? You what? Have a bit. This is left over from an old batch, but should be a swig or two there. More than enough to loosen you up, I'll wager. What do we need? This and that. Let me know when you want to work out the details. Alrighty, let's do it. There are too many tonic. ingredients, but I brew large batches, so we need a good bit of each. We'll need uh, punga fruit, yeast, and some fishing batteries for that extra oh, little kick. That's why they're everywhere. That's why you got fishing batteries all over the place. She hastes. Uh, we need punga, punga fruit. fruit. And lots of it. The stuff those loonies make at the church is best. Ten of those will do, but might cost you. Wild fruit will do the trick, but you'll need twice as much of it. Um... Yeast, well, of course. There's yeast, yeast everywhere. Yeah. You can find it about anywhere, but there's a big stash on the boardwalk. Three sacks is enough. Batteries. You best keep this one to yourself, sweetie. The family tonic gets real kick from our secret ingredient. We need just a little bit of battery acid. <laughs> oh, don't look like that now. <laughs> you reckon I'd be around to tell you about it if it weren't safe enough? Bring me six fishing batteries, and I'll scrape them into the mix. We need fung punger. For yeah, that. ten from the growers at the cathedral, or twenty wild ones. I thought you'd never ask. Um, it still looks like it could be fixed up. Could it now? I suppose you'd know how to see to that, wouldn't you? I can fix it up. Call it 100 caps for the work. Get it working like new, but I want 200 caps. I reckon you've got a deal, sweetie. But I better notice a difference in the tonic. All right. Where's her still? Repair. Perform the necessary repairs. Did I do it? I don't know if I did. All right, it's repaired. Thanks for mending the steel, sweetie. For this fee, the tonic had better taste like honey, though. All right. Um, what well, about you, babe? I'm just folk. What more is there? Why'd you fake being sick? <laughs> yeah, I thought you were a quick one. 
Look, sweetie, I reckon you'd have shot me as soon as you walked in here if you weren't a kind soul. Or at least an enterprising type. That old that thing's been in my family for years and years. Well before the bombs, there was a time folks couldn't get no tonic by law. And my family did okay helping them get what they needed. What do you think of Point Things Lookout? aren't wonderful, but I reckon it's hard all around. My family's lived here about since, whew, well before the war, and I reckon we'll be here a long time yet. All right. I thought you'd never ask. Hmm. All right. Don't be a stranger now. So what do we got in the way of fishing batteries and punga fruit? We only got three of those. How many fish? I got five fishing bears. She needs seven? Is that what she said? Six fishing batteries. Okay, so that's pretty good. Three bags of yeast. And ten refined punga fruit or twenty wild punga fruit. So I got enough fishing batteries, don't I? I had seven. She needs six, I had seven. No, I need. I have five. Well, I got a bunch of them back at the hotel too. All right, let's do this. Uh, get some medics there, eh? All right, let's go get my get my armor back on before I go outside because that could be bad. Uh, let's put on Sydney's. Where is Sydney's thing? I want to. Maybe I need to favor that again. Go back to the hardware store. Make some more grenades. Where's the hardware store at? Here? Yeah, these hardware. Go make some grenades real quick. I think there were some yeast or fishing batteries out here. Where's his... This place is weird. It's hard to figure out where we're at here. This is all steel, all this stuff? Yeah, okay. Alright, let's make some nuka grenades. Cool. So we're loaded for bear. And trackers. Let's look outside. And what's up on a hill there? I think that's where we got. That's the church up there. And yeast? I think there was an ass load of yeast back at the hotel. I thought there was some yeast here somewhere. I think it was back at the hotel in all the wardrobes. There's none here. Um, yeah, we got a couple of minutes to screw around. Let's go. She said there was some on a boardwalk. Where was there some on a boardwalk? Let's go there. Where was there a yeast at on the boardwalk? Let's look. Over here somewhere? In the lockers, maybe? And how did she know that? It's an ashtray. Huh. There be yeast on the boardwalk. There's not many containers out here. Let's see what's up here.
There's that little area that's right over here, the bumper cars. Ski ball. She needed three bags of yeast. All right, so we got three bags of yeast. Those probably weigh a lot too, I bet. Check that out. Uh, what would that be under? Yeast? Yeast. Uh, yeah, that weighs four pounds. Let's go stick. Can I fast travel to the hotel? Yeah, let's go there. Just like right over here. Stick the yeast in there for now until I can get it. And we're going to stick the punga fruit in there too. And then we'll collect it up later. If it really makes sense, I don't know. I think it, yeah, there it was. And then wild punga fruit, that would be under aid. And then fishing batteries, how many fishing batteries do I have in here? I have seven in here and I got another five on me. This weight, and we don't need to abraxo anymore either. And a scrap metal, put that in there. Alright, that helps a little bit. Hey, so we're back in the hotel room. So we'll call the video right here. And then we'll get back, and what we'll do is we'll just fast travel right back to Marguerite Shack. And then we'll start heading up from there. We're going to go from here to here. So we'll do that. So. If you're watching, thanks for watching. See ya.